Hey everybody, HMV here, playing more Darkest Dungeon, and we're going for yet another boss. We are going for the Brigand 12-pounder, one of the harder bosses in the game, for one of the trinkets I don't really like, but we'll sell it. I've been selling trinkets, uh, all the dark stuff, for uh, for money, and money's always good. So uh, what do we got here? We've got um, Goddard, who was actually on the last uh, expedition. Um, he's basically the same as he was before, um, just with more dodge. Um, we've also got Rivers, who was not on the last mission, but um, she's on this one. <laughs> um, her whole thing is going to be blighting um, and also throwing her dagger a lot. Uh, mostly these two to uh, to take care of the people who um, who need taken care of. Uh, then we've got Lee Borg, who's gonna uh, remember, unlike his partner, to uh, use the dog treats in the other in the in the uh, in the fight. Uh, his main thing, though, is just gonna be Hounds Rush at whatever he can. Uh, and then, of course, we've got a vessel. Who, she heals. What are you going to do? Um, she's also got Ginny's head and uh, the solder crown to take care of Ginny's head because we are going to make sure the torch stays above 75, uh, partially by dazzling light and partially by uh, using a lot of torches. Um, I'm moderately confident. If we can make it there, I think we'll be fine. I just, uh, you never know uh, against the, the brigands. I, 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 I'm not very good at this fight, so we'll see what happens. The war machine is close. The war machine is anything but close. Holy cow. Let's get going. <laughs> Gotta love the wield. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. I always remember my first time fighting the Brigand 12-pounder, or the 16-pounder, the biggest one. Um, took me like four turns, four tries just to get there. And who knows, maybe we'll have that luck this time as well. Oh boy, this is going to be fun. Yeah. I almost want to use a dog biscuit here, but I don't think I'm going to. Come on, we need crits. We need crits and lots of them. We also need repost. Although I hate to put a target on his head. Don't think we have a choice, and things are not looking good. Things are looking better. <laughs> nice kill. Destroy them all. Get some bleed on him. Okay, one more turn, he's dead. Um, what is your stun chance? 129, you have no additional stun chance. Yeah, I think that's the smart one. Uh, nobody needs healing except for you, so go ahead and get yourself some. Yay, Blight. Uh, yep, long slog. Really nothing else we can do except for just keep piling it on him. Well, the dodge trinkets are definitely working. As they tend to at the lower levels like this, um, at the expert level, dodge isn't as good as accuracy generally, but uh, every bit counts. Okay, we need to do three damage to him. Oh, that is beautiful. You're doing well. Uh, okay, <laughs> that's... It's a little bit more than three, but you know what? We'll take it. Success so clearly in view. Or is it nice. merely a trick of the Definitely light? take those. Um, also probably should have done this. Three damage per round for a round. You're already healed up. We're, we're probably going to be tossing those anyway. Might as well use them. Probably should have used it a lot earlier, but oh well. Yeah, we can't use a shovel on a wall on a grave when there's a wall right here. Nature herself. There's no way we're coming back, so we're admitting that it's gone. Tent. 
It's like an M. <laughs> That's like falling over to the left. One thing we have plenty of is food. Got two good scouters. You think I would get more scouts than I'm getting? Uh, bandages. Oh. Oops. <laughs> oh well. At least I got the inventory slot right. I think I'm gonna duck down this hallway, even though we're already going crazily long here. Um, okay, stress dealer is first, because we don't have good stress healing. Okay, that lowers his dodge, I believe. It does, and his accuracy. But not bad enough to, to not kill. A faint hope blossoms. Um, let's go ahead and, we wanted to raise the torchlight, let's go ahead and raise the torchlight here. I think we're possibly going to play the stunning game here. Confidence does at that. Search. And driven into the mud. Although I'm scared that we only have one more shovel. And we could use the food. Ah, oh, we probably don't need the food. Who has the best blight resist? 70, 90, 70, and 70. Okay, you have the best blight resist. Go ahead and try this. You are distraught. You are now afraid of zoos. Okay, I don't know what the best first choice is, but, oh, she can't poison dart from the second row. That ruins my whole plan. I wonder if he could move up to the to the third row. We'll, we'll look at that after this is over. Um, yeah, I think our best bet is to kill you two as quickly as possible. Amusingly, I don't want him to die from bleeding out, but I think we're going to lit him. He resisted both of those. That's cute. Should probably get his repost on because he's already marked. kill this guy as quickly as possible. Impressive. And that just did it. Hopefully this guy will go first. Um, try to stun him again. Come on. There we go. Yay, blight everywhere. The slow death unforeseen. Unforgiving. Okay, he's dead. Nice. A death by inches. Against my better judgment, I'm going to do that to heal the whole group up. And healed as many points as he took. So. What are you going to do? Uh, he doesn't have his own heal, which kind of sucks. Let's go ahead and do that. I think he's dead now. Nope. No, he's not. Now he is. Wow. A lot of goodies. That overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Okay. I want those. But I don't want to drop anything for them. 
so we're going to leave. And against my better judgment, we are going to not go that way because that's our last shovel. <laughs> so let's go ahead and open this ancient coffin. And move on. Instantly want the food from this. Uh, is she the one with zoophobia? Yeah, so we'll just do this again. That way she Wealth can't get zoophobia twice. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Ah, uh, you, I guess. <clears throat> oh, can't take it? Well, let's light it. In Radiance, may we find victory. Generally, in Radiance, we are finding victory, but this looks kind of scary. Um, yep, yeah, let's get rid of these guys as quickly as possible. Cleansed from our lands. Supposed to dodge those. Another one falls. Uh, her stun chance is not great. We're gonna try it anyway. It's crit. Keep trying, eventually someone will stun him. Nice crit there. Okay, we should be able to kill him before he moves again, I would think. We can do two damage to him. There we go. Now, ideally, she'll be able to heal him before he moves. And again, I want both of those things. Um, 500 gold, though. Wow, what do you drop? Um, I'm using I think I dropped this. Yeah. We're just getting too much stuff. Not enough scouts. Oh, jeez. Yeah, we're gonna have to do a lot of shuffling here. Um, but not you. A decisive pummeling. Okay, she's dead in two turns. I think we're gonna have to leave her just just because we're spending so much time doing other things. Okay, she can blight for one, so let's go ahead and do that. I don't want him in the front row. He can't actually do that. Okay, let's go ahead and move him forward. <laughs> um, so let's do this, just to kill her so she doesn't get another stress move off. Because our man-at-arms is already hurting. Ah, this is better than moving. Do I want to heal or do I want to hurt? I think I want to stun. Uh, four, five, six. He's at ten, so he's dead. We can just help ourselves here. Um, that's right, I wanted to see what his chances are were in, in the second slot here. But sadly we can't do that now because I just moved him. Nice, that's perfect. Crit healed the guy who needed the most healing. Um, 
just for the fun of it. <laughs> uh, might as well bolster again. Although he could have gotten the kill and that would have uh, helped him out a bit. Oh well. Seize this momentum. Push on. Yeah, we'll just toss that. End. We don't need it. Okay. If you're in the second slot, you can't cry havoc, but you can stun. Which might not be terrible. If you're in the sl third slot, you can do everything. So yeah, I think we're going to do that. We're going to take off Cry Havoc, we're going to add Stun, and we're going to switch you guys' places here. And you're currently switched, so we're not going to hit that switch button. Um, this is Anti-Venom, but I think we're going to try it here. Nice, more Onyx. Oh, we, that we threw away already. And gold. Ugh. The only things we have that are throw awayable are up here. And none of them are throwawayable, so let's go ahead and leave it. Oh, I just hate throwing away that much money. We're not getting any scouts. So the chances of finding the secret room are low. Which of course means we're going to find it now that we're in this room. Nope, okay. <laughs> Once again, we, we can't uh, do the full camp because now we don't have enough. Oh, we do have enough food. We have 12 here, um, which makes me kind of want to toss this food. Yeah. Because we can eat four in a hunger check and then... Uh, Curious is the trap maker's art. His efficacy on eight in the camp. His own eyes. Okay, fairly easy fight. I don't know why I bothered even trying that, but oh well. Um, let's do this. We kind of want to keep them all alive as long as possible, so that they don't, uh, so they don't make more. But it's not a huge deal. We just want to get them down as close as possible, and then that way we just kill them all one by one really quickly. Unless, of course, we get reposts on them. It's all ending on this guy to get him down as low as possible. As long as neither of them do cytokinesis, we should be fine and be able to kill him this turn. Okay. Oh! The match is struck. A blazing star is born. 17 damage because you missed. Good job there. Okay. Um, we're going to waste her turn. Go ahead and guard her. Not that it matters. That's what I wanted. A victory. Perhaps the turning point. I am impressed at how few scouts we've gotten. It's trapped. And now she's bleeding. There's nothing we can do about it. Okay, let's keep moving. <laughs> I'm going to leave this sack here. We're actually going to peek down this hall before we do anything. Oh, we got some guys to fight here. Okay, let's get the torch light up. Let's go and do that. That lowers their bleed resist. Doesn't lower their crit chance, though. Um, I think I want to kill him first. Precision 
God, every crit in the world. Okay, he's dead now at least. We're, yeah, we're gonna be just all covered in blight and bleed and everything. Then stun this guy, might as well. Give us an actual chance to do stuff. Can you not crit every single move? Seems unreasonable. Yeah, Vestal has her job. That makes her daggers much more attractive because it'll kill him. Oh, I wanted to Hounds Harry, but it didn't take the one. It took the click, but not the one. Oh, do I want to do this? I could stun this guy. Guaranteed kill. I gotta take it. Especially when he's a crit. Of course, that just makes him blight, which we can't really take too much of. Okay, there's a stun. Give us a little bit of a reprieve. I'm actually doing this so the Vestal has a chance to do some healing here. gonna try to cheese the fight but that hasn't been doing very well for me hey we got a scout of course we found the secret room okay well we have three chances to uh to get a key so i'm going to uh i'm gonna camp here yes we're gonna camp a moment of respite Need as much food as we can. The then we're going to take the onyx and toss the citrine. Okay. We know exactly what we're going to do. We're going to do weapons practice, tactics, and hounds watch. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted. Then we're going to go back here. Purpose is made clear. See if there's a key in this sack. There is not. We're going to go here. See if there's a key in whatever's here. There's not going to be a key here. Troubling effigy. I don't remember what these are. Hold, hold on a second. Holy water is a positive quirk. Um, we don't have any holy water, so I'm not going to do it. Okay, we also have no key, so I'm going to skip the secret room. We're going to go take care of these guys. Maybe we'll get lucky and they'll drop a key. Probably not, but hey. Um, also, I think I'm going to eat the food. You're going to eat it all. Okay, we are going to dog bone. We are going to heal the group, and we're going to bolster, and she's going to, these two are going to attack, is the way it's going to work. Wow, we surprised them. Okay. Um, well, let's start by killing Cam. That's job one. It makes everything easier. Uh, we are also now going to use our dog bone and try to kill one of these guys as quickly as possible. Because if we can get the numbers advantage quickly, we're good. Could have done more damage. Do I want to heal the group yet or do I want to stun this guy? Let's play the control game. 
because that way he'll, he can only bring one guy back and then these guys ideally will die next turn. Both. I ideally want to kill them both on the same turn. Nice dodges. I'm hoping for a lot of those, actually. Obliterated. So far, she's been awesome. Decimated. Uh... I think now we can heal the group. And then he's going to kill him. Actually, now we don't need to kill him, which is awesome. Because the, the he can't bring him back if we don't kill him. Um, I'm going to hit the hit the cannon. Might as well get started here. Ideally, he'll only bring back one guy. He did, and then this guy's going to die. So we're actually really well off. Okay, he's dead. So now we can start hitting it. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, with any luck, he'll only pull one guy back. And he did. Awesome. This is the way we like it. Didn't kill him, what? Uh, you want to use that? I wanted Hounds Harry. I hate it when the game doesn't uh, <laughs> doesn't do what I want. So far, we're doing pretty good. We're about a third of the way done with the with the guy. That was annoying. The bad guys are once again. OPing the uh, the crits there, although we apparently are as well. Okay, he's dead in two turns. He's dead in one turn. The light, the promise of safety. And now we're officially at one third. Probably could heal the man at arms. A powerful blow. But we're doing so well. We're getting lucky with the uh, reinforcements as well. Yeah, dogs versus cannons. Not a very good choice there. <laughs> what are you going to do? Yeah, the cannons got some, uh, uh, they, they didn't get all the, the background black off of it uh, when they were doing it. When you notice when we hit it, it, it actually shows there's like some black spots in front of it. It's a graphical glitch. That was a crappy throw. I think we gotta, we gotta make sure we get rid of him. We're doing so well, we don't want to screw up now. You're supposed to crit. I don't understand. Why didn't you crit him? Her. Uh, could have justified a uh, stun there, but she could stun him. I don't know why she didn't throw a dagger at this guy. She should have. The <coughs> quakes. Tactical error here. Nice dodging. We'll do a Hounds Harry, hopefully killing both of these guys. Dodge Trinkets are really coming in handy. Okay, he did not get bled. Oh, he did get bled. Four. He's at five. Sadly, he'll live. This guy needs some help to, to, to live. What's her blight? 
four points. It's not enough, so let's go ahead and throw this in. He's dead, but he's not. So let's change that. Twenty points. We're getting close. Round ten. Yeah, consistently killing the matchstick man is one of the most important parts of this. Thirteen. Nine. I can feel it. Can you feel it? We're almost there. We could probably all in on the on the cannon, but why bother? With bleed, he's gone. We will. Um, oh, she can't throw at the cannon. So go ahead and throw at him. Six points. Four points. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to ignore this guy. We're going to ignore the matchstick man, too. A corpse, Never mind. Twisted metal and splintered wood. At home amongst the headstones. We weren't supposed to resist the stun. <clears throat> With the bleed, he's dead now. One guy left. Key, no key. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Okay, we're gonna hopefully not hit a food a food activation here. Good. Sadly, we just had to open it. That's better than nothing. Actually, this is better than this, and nothing is better than that. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay. We did well. We did well. And we're... A quarter of the way through the bosses of the veteran level, which is not bad at all. Um, could probably get rid of Fangophobia. And we got another guy at level five, so we got three level fives. The poor caretaker. Oh boy, the Shrieker. I fear his long-standing duties here have affected him. Yeah, this guy needs uh, to be attacked because um, he'll steal trinkets out of our trinket inventory. Um, However, he's very difficult to beat without level six people. So we might let him sit for a few weeks. Um, and the Shrieker stuff isn't great because it's all darkness and I don't do darkness very much. So next time we are probably gonna go to the Warrens or the Cove, uh, depending on what we wanna do. Possibly the Cove to, to try to get people up to level six. We might even do something like all of these, these four going somewhere. It's a pretty good group. Um, we got some stress to deal with, and none of these guys can really do stress, so maybe that's a bad idea. But uh, what I'm thinking is, if we if we can get these guys up to level six quickly, then we can uh, they can they can own the Shrieker is the idea. Um, but we'll figure that out next time. I hope you're looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to doing it. I'm HMV, and I will, as always, talk at you later.